Hey there guys, JCD Goku here, bringing you guys another video of Dragon Ball Z Doken Battle. And today, uh, we are going to talk to talk about my physical units in my box. And if you guys didn't know, the latest news that came out last night, which I was sleeping, uh, was that we are getting Ultra Instinct Goku. Which kind of sucks, because I am not ready for him, or to do any summons. Um, couldn't come at a worse time of the of the holidays, but I'm gonna see what I can do to get some stones so I can summon for him and uh, run a team. Because he's a pretty amazing unit. If you guys seen a few videos on JP, uh, he's a good dodging unit when his health is below 50%. But overall, the card art looks amazing. Can't wait for his Doken Awakening form. But let's get things started here. We have got Omega. Shinron, the physical. He is. People don't like his uh, his category, but I think it's pretty decent. I mean, you can run quite a bit of good units in there, but overall, I think he's pretty cool. I finally pulled a dupe of him. I think I only have one in the dupe system of him, which I was only able to pull one. And then finally, I was able to pull Cooler. And I pulled a dupe. And if I do double check, I'm pretty sure he's got one. Yeah. One and one. Yeah, so it's fine. That's per that's perfect. I actually like that because you know at least having him in the dupe system helps out because he has the ability to do crits. And then here I got Everybody thought he was going to be the new LR, but no, he's still here. I got him rainbowed. Um, used him quite a bit. It's been a while, but I still need to get the physical Gotex, which I don't think I'm going to pull on that banner just yet. I'm going to wait for uh, I'm going to wait for the for Saturday, I believe people are talking about. Um, see what kind of banners are coming out, but I do have them at uh, crit 15, which that's as high as you can go, I bet, I believe. And next I got Goku Black here. Goku Black. What can I say about this man? He is an amazing unit because of that key. He gets, uh... Wow, I just went blank. Well, it says it right there. Extreme types, three key. Which, JP does not have that. So, global? Thumbs up. But, uh, yeah, he's, he's an amazing. He's kind of a small, a small nuker in a way. And he does lower attack and defense, which is awesome. Two of the best things to lower. And next, we got the god, god leader, uh, Broly, the old god leader. Which a lot of people don't like, but I I think he's pretty cool. When I first got him, I, I used him quite a bit. And I did put some in the, in the dupe system, and he's he has the potential to be 100%, you know, rainbow, but... I don't see myself doing that just yet, because there's a lot of better, better units coming out soon, which I need to save the orbs. And then we got uh, Goku here, grade 8 form, he token awaken from the original one. And uh, yeah, I don't have much to say about him, but he's, he's a good character to have on your team for the World Tournament category, if you don't have another unit. And then here we got the Super Saiyan Goku. Angel Super Kaioken. That's a tongue twister. Uh, him, he's hard to obtain right now because he's not. I, I can't. I don't think you can get him right now in any of the summons. But he had his own banner for a while. Um, I believe I pulled one or two dupes of him. And then next we got Sid Shinron. Uh, I got him. 100 or actually all four do pass open he's a super attack 8 no elder kai is used it's how many i fold of him quite a bit quite a bit and then we got super saiyan gold tanks what can i say about this other amazing units he hits for over a million guys um he is worth the orbs because he can go in a lot of teams Especially the fusions team, the physical team, you can go on the mix, mix, mix saying category, 
Uh, he's got quite a bit of teams you can run him on, especially since he's a sealer. He's he's awesome. I, I really recommend you guys to rainbow him if you guys have him or can. And then here we got full power Frieza. I have a few dupes sitting around of him also, and he can be 100%, but I haven't done that yet. Like I said before, orbs are precious. You can't just spread them out like crazy. But farm those orbs every day, guys. Yeah, they'll be worth it. But yeah, he's. I can get him. I think I put maybe two other guys in him, which I shouldn't have done, but that was a long time ago uh, when he first came out. And, and recently I've been pulling a lot, especially when the ticket banner came out for uh, a while back, the very first one. Uh, told you how many stones you use for every multi you did, you got a ticket and stuff like that. So. I pulled quite a bit of them there, max them out. Then we got Pan here. She is Super Attack 10 because I was able to get the SR ones and to feed into her. Got her, and I think I got all her dupe pads open also. And I think her litter ability is pretty decent. It's not, it's not bad, it's not horrible, but it's, it's decent. And then we got here the nuke leader, Vegeta which I got him Super Attack 4. I used a couple of his characters to put into my int, uh, Goku, uh, Vegeta. But, yeah, he's a nuker. If you guys need a nuker for farming the bunny event, if you have him, put him up front and get the physical Goku, which I'll show you guys in a little bit. Then we got Ultimate Gohan, which I used a lot back then because of that three key. But right now, he's not that great, great of a unit other units you can use better than that and then here we got kid who I have quite a bit extras of him but I, like I said in the last video I think I'm saving those for it kid boo so I can raise his super attack then next we got Bardock Super Saiyan Bardock he's also a unit that you want to have on your team if you don't have uh, Gold tanks, the sealing type, because he also seals. And he's Doken Awakened, so he's pretty awesome. Um, I like his card art, it's pretty cool. Bardock is actually one of my favorite characters in a way. I did cosplay as him. Um, uh, I don't know if I, I think I posted a few pictures on my Twitter if you want, guys want to check them out. I did dress up like him, and I did make the body armor, this chest plate armor, and the hairdo. I made the hairdo, the hand straps, and all that stuff. Uh, yeah, if you guys check it out, it's on my Twitter. It's on there. It's pretty awesome. I, I That's one of my favorite uh, outfits that I made. I do have Goku, but he's one of my first that I made, so I <laughs> hope you guys enjoy it. But here we got the free-to-play uh, Nappa, which I still need to work on his super attack. Um, I actually sold quite a bit of them back in, back in the past, and, and I just didn't care about it, but now I should have. But yeah, he's a great leader. If you don't have Broly, you can use him as your leader. He's not bad. And next we got Kyo, uh, God, Super Saiyan God Goku. Yeah, this is a free-to-play one, which he ain't bad. He's a good unit. Uh, he's a good support for, for the strength and physical. He and attack plus 25, which is really good. Yeah, that is pretty good. His leader ability, it's missing the, the healing, but overall, he's a good support if you don't have any other supporters. And then next we got Boo here, which I did farm his super attack, was was a grind. But I don't think he was worth it, but if you don't have other units, go, you know, go for it. Something to do on Dokkan. Then we got this other Super Saiyan 2 Goku. Uh, I believe he's... I don't. I do have his normal state, um, but yeah, he's also a Doken Awakened character. He's just uh, breaking the limit. Super Attack Three, not bad. Then we got this guy is amazing to have because he's a good defense unit. If you need a blocker, this guy's your man right here. Defends seventy percent to all allies, including himself, which is awesome for physical types. Then we got the legend, Weirus. I was 
I was unfortunately lucky that I was able to pull three of this man. Three of them. So I kept one and I used two for the dupe system. And I did put four Elder Kai's in him because I do enjoy using this card. For one, because uh, he changes a lot of orbs on the field. Which can help you out when, uh, or uh, I believe LR. LR Trunks? Can I say that? LR Trunks? Yeah, he, he, he'll he help LR Trunks hit pretty hard. And he'll always get his, uh, his super attack. Um, yeah. So, may I say any more? I did put some orbs in him. Because I do use them and I want him to actually hit. And, uh, and stuff. So, next we got Kale. Do you need to say much about her? I only pulled one, which I was lucky enough to pull her. I think I pulled her on uh, Gogeta's Banner, which I was unfortunately I wasn't able to summon on that uh, Kefla or Khalifa and and Kale uh, Banner. But I'll be I'll be ready for the Kefla, Khalifa or no, Kefla fusion one. Here we got the semi free to play 17. And I think I showcased him once on the team, which was pretty awesome. Especially since he has big bad bosses. Then we got Super Saiyan. This guy should be getting his Doken Awakening soon, also. Or Rebirth. Got him at Super Attack 8, which isn't bad. I think I put 2 on his dupe system, I believe. And then this guy, he's also an, an amazing support. A lot of support units for physical types. Once he Doken awakens, of course. Once he Dokens, he's gonna be an amazing support unit you can run. I haven't Doken awakened him yet. Um, I don't know. I don't remember why, but I haven't got around to it. This guy, Mira. He's he's pretty cool. I like I like Mira since I'm a fan of uh, Xenoverse. Um, Black Kamehameha. Not bad. Uh, this guy, I can't say his name, I'm not going to try. Um, he's a free-to-play unit, I've used him before, I showcased him once against Gogeta. And he did really good. Then you got Super Saiyan 2 Goku, GT, Super Attack 6, and he's awesome because he can uh, launch a Super Attack at 9 key. And he's good support. Looks like three key attack. Not for himself, sorry. But yeah, not bad. This guy, he changes orbs, which can help out for physical. I don't want to get too much into him because he's not that amazing. This guy, guys. This guy. If you guys don't have him yet, if you guys do not have Broly. I'm letting you guys know now. He's going to dunk and awaken to Super Saiyan 3 Broly. And he's. An awesome free-to-play Broly. So start farming him, and I can't. Rem I think it. Uh, I think he's gonna take the new Broly's medals, but farm him up or farm extras if you're planning to get uh, get Broly. I'm letting you guys know he is an amazing unit. I've seen the showcases of him. I guarantee he's he's worth it. Then we got the other Nuker Goku, which I'm not going to talk about much. Then we got the World Tournament Boo, Super Attack 7. I'm saving the other ones for the other Boo that I need for my team. Then we got him, Super Attack 5. The Free to Play, uh, Super Saiyan 2, that also Dokens Awakens to uh, Super Saiyan 3, Angel Goku. Then we got this Goku, which is OG. He needs a Dogon. Super Attack 7, he gets one pretty soon, I believe. Got him ready to go. Uh, Super Saiyan Trunks, I haven't Doken Awaken. Super Attack 7, and I'm gonna speed this up a little bit because I don't want to make it too long. Hyuken Goku, him, I undoken him so I can work on his SA, but I haven't got around to it, which sometimes I don't really feel like it, but I need to. Then we got this old school Vegeta, he Doken Awaken soon. We got Mecha Frieza. King Cold. This is a Goku telling you to use against uh, the rabbit event. 
you get almost the Bulma characters to Doken Awaken, you use him and the Nuker uh, Vegeta, so he can hit harder and you can get through it faster. Which is also pretty cool. Then we got Bulma here. I got quite a bit of physical units. And then we got the free to play Taka, Taka, Tika, whatever from uh, the Fusion video game, Dragon Ball Fusions. I just farmed him up. He, if you need a free to play unit, he's one to go with. He'll help out because he hits pretty hard. Uh, decent. I'm not going to say hard because he's not that amazing. Free to play gold tanks here, or fat gold tanks. Super attack, 10. And uh, yeah, guys, looks like that's the whole thing. So I'm going to go ahead and put the rest of this. So you can see the rest, all the extra ones I have. I do have him, but I didn't Doken Awaken him, or awaken him yet. Uh, who else do I have in here? I do have quite a bit of Vegitos. Blue, Goku Blacks, Brolies. Uh, what else do I have in here? See the Kid Boos. Uh, I got this guy here from the Adale banner. This Goku too. Champa and this guy. This guy's also a good unit to have on your team because he's a good blocker, especially for the fusion category. If you need one, you'd be the one to take. I do have quite a bit of extra other ones in here I didn't talk about, but I think I talked about them before. But just so you guys can take a look, what I got in here. I do quite a bit. I do have quite a bit of Goku's, and that's it, guys. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and end the video with a single summon, like I usually like to do, which yeah, I wasn't able to yesterday. Herky on the right doesn't look good. I don't think I'm getting anything. I'm getting an R, unless you break the screen. Not today. Alright guys, I'm gonna end it there. Hopefully it's not too long. And I hope you hopefully you guys enjoyed. And uh, if you guys have any questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like, subscribe, and yeah, start farming that Broly. Get him ready to go. And and be ready for Ultra Instinct Goku and to see what holidays uh, banners we're getting here on uh, Global. So yeah guys, you guys have a wonderful day. Until tomorrow, peace.